Inoculating clover seed is very important because the inoculant contains the rhizobia bacteria that are really responsible for taking the nitrogen out of the air and putting it into the legume plant. To make sure we get the rhizobia present around the seed, we apply the inoculant to the seed immediately before we plant. The easiest way to do that is, is to use a cement mixer such as this, a portable cement mixer that runs off electricity or PTO. We'll be pouring a 50-pound bag of seed into the mixer, then we will add water to moisten the seed, and then we will add a package of inoculant for 50 pounds of seed, and then get the seed coated. We let the mixer run for about 30 or 45 seconds. All your seed should be coated by then. You can dump it back in your, your seed bag and let it dry for at least an hour before you plant. You cannot plant, it when it's, plant the seed when it's wet because it will stick together and clog up your drill. Uh, you don't want to wait much longer than probably 12 or 20 hours, 24 hours uh, between inoculating your seed and planting the seed in the soil. An alternative to for a producer to inoculate his own clover seed is to buy the seed already inoculated. It's called coated seed. It has the inoculant on the seed and then it has a coating which can be lime or fine uh, talcum powder or a clay mineral. And that coating protects the rhizobia on that seed from, from death uh, because they're very sensitive to high temperatures in the sunlight. When you buy the coated seed, the price per pound is about the same as buying uncoated seed, but the problem is that the coating can account for anywhere from 25 to 45 percent of the weight of the coated seed. The smaller the seed, the, the higher percentage the coating will be in terms of weight. And so when you buy a pound of, uh, let's say, crimson clover seed, you get a pound of crimson clover seed. If you buy a pound of coated crimson clover seed, the coating counts for about a third of the weight, so you're getting about one-third less seed in a pound of coated seed compared to uncoated seed. 